Hi everyone, Dennis Foley from Acoustic Fields. The title of this video is Octave Dance. Um, I want to focus on octaves because they're really important to acoustics and how we hear sound. And I think if we break it down into its fractals, if you will, um, we'll have a little bit better understanding of what we need to do to our rooms and, and what we need to look at in terms of measurement. So. What is an octave band? Well, it's the upper frequency, which is twice of the lower frequency. And you can see in this chart here, uh, with the one-third octave band breakdown, how that relationship holds up. And most of your real-time analyzers are based in, you know, third octave bands, uh, 12 octave bands, one twelfth, you, you, 24th, you, you can get resolution all the way up as high as you want. I think I saw one the other day, 164th. But Look at the chart, study the chart, you're going to start to see the relationships that these octave bands are, are all about, okay? So let's do a little experiment. Let's get some, some music playing in your room, and let's open the RTA app, and you can get this in the Apple Store, and you can see here, here's the icon that you want to look for. So look for that, and then fire the uh, app up. Just use the microphone in your phone. I mean, we're just trying to use this for illustration purposes and watch how the octave bands move watch how they move in relationship to each other watch how they move in relationship to the groupings of each other how are they divided into two groups three groups four groups are they moving independently are they moving in groups let's kind of get a feel for that observe the attack and the decay rate when you have an octave band here and it strikes and then you see the decay rate okay notice this difference here that's the attack and decay okay fundamental and the harmonic you want to look at that relationship we're not i don't want to get too technical here but i i want you to start to get a feel for what music looks like on an uh, RTA and you know what it sounds like in your room. So we're going to try to get a feel for those kind of situations. Now in this video I'm going to I'm going to end the video with a question and I, and I want everybody on, on the YouTube channel to kind of respond and jump in and let's have a discussion. No name calling please. I mean let's just keep this academic. Uh, no comments about my ponytail please. Thank you. I'm, I'm my age, I'm glad to have my hair. So, and I don't like haircuts. So, just stay focused on the subject matter, what we're trying to do here, and look at the RTA movement that you have open and look at the music that you're playing. And let's ask ourselves this question Is this the kind of movement we want? Is this our goal? Is this the measurement of the room we want? Okay, in real time. So, let's start the discussion. And let's see what everybody has to say about it. So look at look at everything. Open the RTA app. That we, we showed you the icon, the icon. Watch how everything moves, individual or groups. Is it one group, two groups, three groups? Okay. Look at the attack and the decay and get a feel for it. One other thing to look for is look for the modes. Those are the ones that hang around when everybody else is quiet. You can see them. And then look to their harmonic. If this is the fundamental, let's say at 100, the harmonic's going to be 200. Look at the relationship. You can carry that all the way through the RTA. 400. So, I'm sorry, 300. So carry it all the way through and get a feel for what you're doing in terms of what your room looks like on the RTA. That's what we want to do. So keep uh, all of this in mind. And then, <clears throat> excuse me, let's open a discussion and get people's thoughts about it. What's right, what's wrong. Maybe there isn't any right or wrong. But let's get a discussion going and we'll go from there. I'm going to uh, do a series of these videos that are going to end in a question. Let's see how this first one goes. Hope this helps. Thank you. Thank you for watching this video. And if you liked it, please give us a thumbs up. We also have a newsletter that you can subscribe to, so please do that because we offer special price discounts to only those on our newsletter. And then don't forget about our forum. 
We have started a forum on our own website where people ask questions and I usually get a chance every couple of days to look at it. There's an interchange between people on the forum and we'll give you real answers uh, on a regular basis so that'll help you. Thank you.